One week ago, three judges on a Ninth Circuit panel did something quite extraordinary. For all practical purposes, they said that two decisions from the Ninth Circuit regarding the homestead exemption are just wrong. In substance, and in fact, in terms of practicality, that decision from one week ago is in essence urging all of the judges on the Ninth Circuit to sit on banc and reverse their prior decisions from 1986 and 2012. As I said, it deals with the homestead exemption. In those two cases, and in the new one one week ago, the Ninth Circuit was in essence forced to hold because of its precedent that if you do not reinvest the proceeds from the sale of a homestead within a time prescribed by state law, you lose the homestead exemption, even if the exemption was perfectly valid on the filing date. Earlier this year, a panel on the First Circuit flatly disagreed with those two older Ninth Circuit decisions and said it only matters whether you're entitled to the homestead exemption on the filing date. And even if you sell the property later and never reinvest the proceeds, the debtor gets to keep the proceeds from the sale of the homestead. As I said, it looks to me like these three judges in the decision a week ago are urging everyone else on the Ninth Circuit to reconsider, reject the old opinions, and join the First Circuit. I am Bill Rochelle, the Editor-at-Large for American Bankruptcy Institute. My story on this extraordinary Ninth Circuit opinion appears today in my column on the ABO website. I will be back same time next week with something interesting from the world of bankruptcy. Until then, be well, stay safe, and be